So I'm walking here around, you know, f looking, finding a place where I can sleep, and I, I knock on a bloody tiger panzer with the famous 88 cannon on it. Whoa! What a beast! Stupid humanity, eh? Stupid. Look at that. In the middle of the night. There's 700 horsepower, as it said. Yeah. And the best way to shoot them is not from the from the side, apparently. You just knock them out like from the back. Uh, they're most vulnerable. Bloody panzer. Oh, look at that. I hope you can see it. Oh, my battery is almost empty. It is empty. Stupid humanity. And now, you stupid humanity, you kill yourself. And now you're all completely overrun by the third world, eh? Our pharaohs, they let them all in. Because you're so, you were so stupid, eh? Look at that. It's probably still moving, they, they renovated it. It's said, oh. oh, I hope you can see that. Oh, this is horrible, eh? Instrument of death. Okay, you know, we need a little war, yeah? But we need a war against the enemy within, eh? Not against each other, stupid, eh? The Germans didn't even have a chance, you know, they found themselves in a dictatorship and it was too late. Right. Well, right. imagine these sort of things like rolling you over like, you know, look at that. And it says all, you know. It could only go like 38 kilometers an hour on the road. There you go. 38 kilometers. And, uh, what is that? 60 kilometers. You can only, only go 60 kilometers. Yeah. With a full tank. Yeah. Only the cannon was quite superior. It's uh, 700 horsepowers. Yeah. Stupid, eh? It's a Panzerkampfwagen Nummer 6 SDKFZ 181. Stupid. This is a cannon, it's an 88 cannon, where is it? 88 caliber. Two machine guns, caliber 792, 8 millimeters. Uh, so stupid, hey. Eh? Why you do it? Uh. That was the end of Europe, eh? Hey? You did it yourself, stupid. You know why the Germans eventually lost? Because the chains here was not, they were not broad enough, you know, to hold it on the, in the snow. It was too heavy. Hey, they were so arrogant, you thought, oh no, we got the best machine, the best cannon, the best engine in it, the best armor, and a little tiny detail, you know, that, you know, they lost, and the Stalin, the uh, was it the T-34, they had much broader chains and much lighter, so they just they just you know they just went through the snow. And they lost. It's the same thing, you know. The Germans they lost the war in North Africa because of the SAS, the Long Range Desert Group. They just destroyed all the airplanes like manually, you know. They just ripped them apart. 
Uh, no more Luftwaffe, bye bye. So this is why they lost, yeah? look at that. They lost the tank battles in the snow. Aye. Even with the most superior weapons, you know, there's always Mr. Murphy coming by. A nice Swiss, eh? let me be your Mr. Murphy. Eh? I'm going to bring you down, Swiss, eh? eh? You think you're so powerful, you can do whatever you want, eh? Swiss, eh? I'll bring you down, Swiss, eh? The world will know what you did. Hello, Swiss, eh? You're an olid, eh? Look at that, eh? 88, it means they're a Nazi, Swiss power, with a double S, eh? The, um, the H is the eighth letter in the alphabet, so that means, uh, it means Heil Hitler, 88. And all, all Nazis know this. I'm not sure if this is Octagon, you know, look at the Swiss from Solothurn. You're on holiday, Swiss, eh? eh? Me too. Forced and forced holiday, four years now. I see in this part of France you've got all these incredible hedges. You know, look at that. And it was a problem for the Allied, the Allies, to advance. You know, you can't get through it. You know, not even with a tank, maybe. So I could have put my tent like. Uh, I could have opened it, maybe. But I, I could have put my tent here on a nice juicy meadow instead of that. I had to put it here on the stone here. Like that. Couldn't even get my pegs in here, so I, I, I had to use these two stones here. You know, to, to put it there in front of my tent, you know, on this, to keep it all together. This is like the typical, you know, from all these movies, you know, that, you know, soldiers like walking like through the hedges here and then the Germans shooting at them, shooting back and, you know. I didn't know Normandy was that hilly actually. Yeah. Cathedral in the middle of nowhere. Like some more of these hedges. Oh, it's going all the way. I think this is called Bouy. They make baskets out of it. And uh, well, you can't get through it eh? on both sides. Here's the other one. So, you, you know, like in the film with the John Wayne, you know, the Freemason with the, uh, the Muslim cap on. Eh? Uh, Freemasons telling you how to do it, eh? how to go to war, how to kill people. Uh, well, you never get shot yourself, of course. No, I'm John Wayne. I never get shot, eh? I'm, I'm Rock Hudson. I only get shot in the back, eh? I get a full load in the back. And, um, yeah, they're having these things like in the film, you know, click, 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 click. You know, Germans hiding right on the other side, like, go click, click. You know, these little metal things like for kiddies, eh? So they can recognize each other. Um, so how come did they think about this, you know? And like uh, anticipating the hedges. Anyway, they had these click click things, you know? But the rest of the hedges, they didn't know the hedges, but they anticipated with the click click thing. Well, that's kind of weird, isn't it? Then right, there's a meadow behind there. So I'm making me crotum. My third day I'm not gonna eat. Fantastic. So oh, here in Albenga again, you know, Templars are here or the Teutonic Knights. Because this is where they went to before going to Switzerland. I already showed that to you. The uh we call it Via Templar, the road of the Templars. Yeah, Teutonic Knights. It's more like Teutonic Knights than actually. So move. I want to film this. I'm going to take it from the other side. Oh, I can't. This is why they landed, and they got this little island here. 
Santos. <laughs> Templar Town, Albenga, next to the sea with the Treasure Island. And they went to Switzerland, eh? Every year they got this. And they survive. Oi, there's a tiger around the corner. Oi, it's coming at us, eh? He's got an 88, come on. I'll show you again, like here, what it can do. Uh, this is what it can do and what it can't. All the technical uh, things, yeah. Uh, look, they even got an email. Uh, so, you know, you say, I'm still here, I'm still hitchhiking, eh? Nobody takes me. So in the Normans, I'm here in Normandy. I don't even want to go there. So the Normans, they don't even take any hitchhikers. They're not people who will help others. So why didn't you save them, you know? And there's a big rise of fascism here at the moment. Front National and everything, you know? So why didn't you left them just like with the Germans and, you know, it's what they want. They want fascism. They're even looking angry at me. I, I see them swearing, you know, because I got long hair and I'm not having a t-shirt, <coughs> like, you know, standing there, you know. I'm the Untermensch, you know, the underdog or the under man. <sighs> like a lower creature. You, I can see it, man. Why didn't you just, you should have left them with the Germans and don't die for him. Don't follow bloody Freemason John Wayne and Homo Rock Hudson in their videos, eh? They're all lying. Go and make a war. Well, he died in his bed of cancer, didn't he? Hey? So don't, people don't need your help anyway, you know? Don't help the Vietnamese. Instead of helping them, you, you, with carpet bombing, you kill three millions of them and with Agent Orange. Don't go and help the Iraqis. They don't want you there, hey? You, you, you murdered millions of them and their children with the depleted uranium coming out of these sort of things nowadays, right? kills them of cancer don't help the Normans They're a bunch of fascists why right, you stupid don't you know you have to say don't save any other people you have to save yourself from the politicians and don't believe in them you don't believe them don't follow their orders don't execute their orders that's what you should do stupid So this is why you should get them, you know, like uh, uh, the most vulnerable part here. Not the side, not the front, or the front is shooting at you, eh? But the back, you know. Just, uh, just, punch them, just punch them in the back. They know how to do it, probably, eh? Uh, but they would never fight, eh? Yeah. So, Pharaoh. This is Pharaoh, folks. Porsche. He made the engine, he made the whole bloody tank, Porsche. Ferdinand Porsche, like the car. Pharaoh. Me. So who you want to believe? You want to believe Pharaoh? Yeah, look at that. Hey, killing machine. Or you want to believe me? Hey, I tell you, Swissy. They are behind it all, believe me. Swissy is behind all this here, killing millions. Hey Swissy, watch my film, The Swiss Bee is Home of the Devil. 